guys and welcome back to another episode of HF Movie Productions and in today's episode I head out to some brand new charity shops and boy do they have some of the best deals on media. Now let's roll the footage and find out what I picked up from the new charity shops. Okay, now in the first charity shop I'm already seeing a whole bunch of CDs and DVDs all for just four for a pound and box sets only two pounds. So, let's see what they have. They already have Super 8 here. Hang on, Steven Spielberg. A Steven Spielberg movie that I have not seen. If you have seen it, leave a comment down below. But I haven't. And this looks quite good. So, for four for a pound, yeah, I'm going to be picking this up. And three other movies. So, yeah, I'm picking this up. Now, they also have this. Scott Pilgrim. A special edition HMV exclusive artwork thing. I have never even heard of that movie before in my life, so if you have, let me know in the comments. They have a Fast and the Furious there, widescreen edition, Transporter 2. Now, hang on. I think I need this for my collection. I, yes, I do need this for my collection. I don't have it. So, going to be picking this up in the four for a pound DVD section. So, yeah, picking that up. And I'm also seeing other stuff like whatever that is. Don't know, leave a comment down below. I'm also seeing Abduction there. Don't know what that movie is either. Leave a comment down below. The Amazing Spider-Man there. Great movie right there. They also have The Mummy widescreen there. Next to that is Juno. The Jacket there. That's a bootleg there. you got to watch out for those bootlegs. And they also have LA Confidential. Now, this is a special edition DVD with a snapper case, and I've never even seen or heard of this movie, but that artwork has me intrigued, so of course, I'm going to be picking this up for my collection and to watch for just four for a pound. So, I've only got one more. Okay, I only need one more movie to get that four for a pound DVD deal, and I am seeing some pretty cool stuff, but most of this stuff I already have, like iRobot here, already have that brand new and sealed on DVD in my collection so don't need that let's see what they have down here they have Beastie don't know what that is leave a comment down below Avatar I do know what that is still haven't seen the new one if you have leave a comment down below they have Hook here with some weird star packaging there if you know what that is leave a comment down below or is that just some custom packaging that someone's put on that i don't know johnny english the original there that's pretty cool they also have the woman in black with harry potter in that's pretty cool but don't really have any interest in that apart from that it has harry potter in and i've never even heard of it or seen it so gonna pass on that they do have some star wars lego star wars here they do have the padawan menace and a whole bunch of other ones as well but i do already have these but my copy is scratched so that would hang on this i do need they have a set right here of all the movies and i have this exact set but all the discs are scratched so i'm going to be picking this up for just four for a pound this and all the other three titles for just one pound that is a fantastic deal and i'm not seeing that much else to pick up so yeah i think that is probably gonna do it four for a pound four good movies for just one pound they do have some disney there cars all right let's try not to get too distracted four for a pound let's not go and spend any more money four for a pound is enough okay fantastic haul from this charity shop all of these Four movies for just one pound, a four for a pound DVD deal. That's fantastic. Okay, now in the second charity shop, they have a whole bunch of nothing but movies, and the prices are amazing. Children's DVDs are three for a pound, and adult ones are one pound. Now, let's see what they have. They have Transporters 3. Now, I do need this for my collection, so if this is in good condition, I'm going to be picking this up for the collection for just one pound. Now, let's check the condition hopefully this is good come on please be good let's hope for the best come on and that is mint perfect condition that will play perfectly now they also have a couple of blu-rays they have 
Homeland is a complete first season. Never heard of this show before in my life, but it looks pretty good. So for just one pound on Blu-ray, I'm picking up the complete first season of Homeland. This is awesome. Now, they also have 2012 there on Blu-ray as well, as well as Transformers Dark of the Moon Triple Play Blu-ray, the Inbetweeners movie, and also Triple Play Blu-ray, and The Hangover Part 3. Now, 2012 is quite tempting, but take a look at that price. Yeah, £2 for 2012 on Blu-ray. Yeah, I think I'm going to pass on that, and as well as dark of the moon i believe that is one pound if it doesn't have the two pound price on so i don't really know what blu-ray's price i'm guessing they're one pound i'm hoping anyway because homeland the complete first season i am going to be picking up if it's one pound if it's two i don't know i still might be picking it up tron legacy here a disney dvd that i don't have now let's open this up and see if the disc is in there yes it is that is always a good sign that the disc is in there. That's always a good sign. You always, yeah, write that down just in case you forget. Now, let's check if this is mint. And yes, that is an amazing find right here. Now, I don't know if this is in the kids DVD section or whatever. But I'll just ask when we're at the till. But yeah, Tron Legacy, a Disney DVD in mint condition for my collection. Defo pickup. Now, they also have a brand new factory sealed bootleg right here now this is what you need to watch out for everybody this is a brand new and sealed bootleg and all you need to do is check the artwork and you will know straight away so just check around the back and it will normally look slightly off they have the in between this box set there that's pretty cool as well that is quite tempting there they have one fine day that's pretty cool and some chill out scooby-doo the original movie there that's cool as well now let's see what they have in the sort of kids section down here they have some simpsons film festival now hopefully this is in good condition because I don't have this yet in my collection and straight away that's a no this is never going in my collection that is very scratched up that is like a hockey puck right there I am definitely passing on that now let's see what they have in the kids section the proper kids section right here where the DVDs are just three for a pound now hopefully I can find some good kids DVD titles. Now let's go through and see what they have. They have an audiobook straight away. I'm finding an audiobook, not a DVD, no, an audiobook right here. This is the story of Tracy Beaker, Jacqueline Wilson. Now, this I will be picking it up. So if this is three for a pound, which I'm guessing it probably is, I'm gonna be picking that up. Now they also have Scared Shrekness, which I don't have for my collection. But it is a kids DVD, so it's probably not going to be in that good of condition. But, you know, it's worth a look. And, yeah, that is pretty scratched up. So, yeah, going to be passing on the Scared Shrekness on DVD there. That's a weird word to say. Two words right there. Scared Shrekness. I don't know why they decided to call it that. But that's a weird name. And I'm finding some classic The Smurfs. For smurf plastic episodes don't really have any interest in the old smurf series so going to be passing on that but let's see what else they have over here do they have some pet pig yes they do and they also have some octonauts now this i remember watching as a kid and i really really enjoyed that show but probably going to be all scratched up so going to be passing on that and this the batman movie i do need for my collection but guess what probably going to be scratched up so going to be passing on that and it has stickers all over it as well and they also have oliver there at the bottom some other simpson stuff some goosebumps there and some other random stuff that i've never heard of finding nemo uh some fireman sam now i remember this as a kid, I used to watch that all the time, but probably going to be Scratch Show passing on that as well. They do have some Postman Pat. Now, this is awesome. I remember watching this all the time when I was little. This is an awesome find right here. If this is in good condition, I am definitely picking this up. But it's very unlikely, and yeah. 
definitely passing on that. That's a clear no-no right there. That is very, very scratched up. Passing on that. They have some more Simpsons here. It's Christmas with the Simpsons. But let's see if it's in good condition. And yeah, that is pretty messed up. Going to be passing on Christmas with the Simpsons. Oh, that would have been quite good Christmas with the Simpsons, you know. That would have been pretty good find for the collection. But it's scratch, so can't pick it up because it won't play. Now, let's see the Smurfs. I do need this for my collection, but not in that condition. So passing on the Smurfs. That's a quite a good movie as well. And they also have this random box set here of Creature Crawford. So I don't even know what that is. If you know what that is, leave a comment down below. Still trying to find three movies. Just one pound. And it is being a lot harder than I thought it would be. Teen Beach, the movie. Now nah, I'm going to be passing on that. And how hard is it to find three good movies for my collection for a pound? It can't be this hard. Come on. I've got to find something. They have... Night and day here in the kids section. Not sure why that's the extended edition though. That's pretty cool, but I already have that brand new and sealed in my collection. So I don't need that. I am honestly not finding much else. I'm gonna see if they can do let's see let's see if they can do one of the adult titles for three for a pound. I might as well see. But I am also not pitch black! The Chronicles of Riddick pitch black with the Vin Diesel in. Now this Fun fact about this movie, Vin Diesel turned out too fast and furious to be in this movie, which was a complete flop. It's good condition, so I'm going to be picking it up, but I'll carry on saying the story. And uh, apparently, too fast and furious then um, overcame that movie and started earning like 10 times more money. So, yeah, there you go. Should have. Wrong choice there, Vin Diesel. Wrong choice. But anyway, I'm picking up all of these right here fantastic deal now for those of you who don't know i'm trying to recreate my movie room and with trying to recreate the movie room you have to have some cool figures so in this charity shop i am just looking for some cool figures for display and i'm already finding this anakin skywalker for four pounds this is awesome yeah i think i am definitely going to be picking this up this would look awesome in my movie room if you guys would like a movie update let me know now let's see what they have in the records here i know it's very unusual for me to go through the records but you never know because i heard that records are selling for quite a bit now especially ones that are rare but i don't know that much about them so even if there was a rare one there i wouldn't know now let's dive in to the dvds down here now there's not that much but I'm sure there's something in here that I will need to pick up for my collection. And something that will be in that good of condition that I will just have to pick up for the collection or to resell. Now they have Ocean's Eleven there with the snapper case. And here are the prices. DVDs 25p each and box sets are £1. Now let's see if they have any good movies. They have a whole bunch of stuff. And I am dropping it already. Okay, let's just pop those right there and see what they have. And they have, they do have a pretty decent media section, actually. I was underestimating this. Rock of the Ages. Don't know what that is. Leave a comment down below. Some Catherine something. Don't know what that is. Triple X, Vin Diesel. Still haven't seen that movie. Let me know in the comments if you haven't. Let me know if it was good or not, because... Is it worth watching? Let me know in the comments. Now, let's see if they do have anything in here that I am interested in. Big Daddy, that's a great movie. Avengers, The Green Mile, some Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah, already have all of that stuff. So I think that is probably going to do it for this small media section. But don't worry, because they do have a, another media section over here now i think yeah over here right here this is where their media section is and they do have quite a few movies they have fern gully 2 don't know what that movie is leave a comment down below some shrek the third a rubbish movie right there literally one of the worst movies ever made stardust there they have oh this this is awesome 
an Aladdin box set there. That's pretty cool, but already have the Aladdin movie, so don't need that. And what else? They also have Mr. Bean's Holiday, which I do need for my collection. So, yeah, for just 25p, I'm going to be picking this up. Yeah, 25p, great deal for this. Okay, now, what did I just hit? Yeah, that's a loose disc. Okay, okay. Maybe not. I'm going to be passing on Mr. Bean's Holiday, even though I do need it. That is very likely it's going to be scratched, though. So, going to be passing on that. We have Despicable Me here. This I do need because my copy does have a small scratch, so why not? For 25p, let's upgrade right here. For 25p, Despicable Me. Yeah, I didn't even mean to rhyme that. Come on, I'm the new rap god. That's sick. Come on. Now, they also have some Pixar short films there. It also, yeah, I don't know what this is. Pixar short films. Leave a comment down below. More I... of like kind of kids or family DVDs oh, in those boxes. three boxes. Oh, okay, thank you. So as you just heard from the charity shop lady, there is more movies down there in those boxes, but we still haven't gone through these movies. They have a Toy Story there, Disney Pixar, great movie Toy Story is. If you haven't seen it, definitely go watch it. Wait up a couple of seconds. This is an awesome movie right here, Inside Out, with the sleeve on DVD. I still don't have Inside Out on DVD, so yeah. Right here for 25p with the sleeve, definitely picking this up. Now, they have a Walt Disney movie called The Underdog. Now, if you've ever seen this movie, let me know in the comments, because I'm intrigued, but for 25p, I'll pick it up. I'm also picking up Trolls on DVD to replace my scratched one at home, and I've just realised that there's a deal. Four for 50p, so let's go with that deal and pick up four movies for 50p. Now, finally diving into the hidden movies, and they do have some pretty cool stuff. But nothing I really need for my collection in the first box. They have The Incredible Hulk. That's a pretty good movie. Shrek the Third. Rubbish movie in there. But nothing I really need or want for my collection. The Huel. Not sure what that is. Leave a comment down below. They have Hook, Stuart Little 2. Shrek 2. Another copy of The Underdog. Yeah, nothing I'm really too interested in. Fantastic Mr. Fox. Ice Age 2. So, nothing in the second box. What about the third? Let's see. They do have some Night at the Museum Secret of the Tomb, but already have that on Blu-ray. The Host. Not sure what that is. Leave a comment down below if you have seen it or if it's any good, because I haven't seen it or even heard of it. Now, they do have some Narnia as well and Stormbreaker as well. They have some pretty cool stuff. But nothing I'm really interested in or nothing I really need either. They have some Peter Pan as well. Hang on, I have never heard of this Peter Pan before. If you have, leave a comment down below. This one I'm not familiar with. I'm familiar with the uh, other Peter Pan movies and stuff. But not that one. So just let me know in the comments. But I think that is probably going to do it for all the movies. Now let's dive into the video games and CDs which are up here. They're, let's start things off with a DS game which is called Brain Training. To see how old your brain is. Literally the most boringly sounded game I've ever even heard of. I'm not even sure if that's a word. Boringly sounded? I don't know. Leave comments down below. Assassin's Creed 2 there for the PS3. Madden. 13 for the PS3, Assassin's Creed, some Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, not, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4, I'm sorry, I'm losing my mind, not Warfare 2, Madagascar, and some Winnie the Pooh, and some maths, wow, okay, nothing is interesting me at all here in the video game section, and there's not even that many CDs, so I think that's going to do it for this charity shop. So overall, a pretty fantastic haul. Definitely, definitely going to be revisiting this charity shop sometime in the future. Now in this charity shop, they don't have any physical media whatsoever. So you're probably wondering, why am I going into this charity shop then? Well, it's for the DVD and VHS players that they have. They have some awesome ones here and they are all for some great deals. Look, 50 pounds there. 
Okay, maybe not the best deal on that one, but it is a Blu-ray player, so that explains the price. £35 for this VHS double player. We have a keyboard here, let's play some music, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm, I don't even know how to play the keyboard. They have some TVs as well. How much are the TVs? We've got £45 for this one. That's probably not a bad deal. And what do they have over here? £10 for this DVD player, you see? This is why I like going into this charity shop. £20 for this one. Okay, yeah. This is what I wanted to show you guys. Just the amount of awesome stuff they have in this charity shop. Well, th this is it. This is, this is their awesome stuff. There's nothing really that much else i can show you if you want but yeah this is it they have some monitors there as well that's pretty cool i was about to call them pcs but they're not pcs are they they're monitors they also have an awesome keyboard right there which i can't play but yeah that is it for this charity shop the rest is just tables chairs and sofas so that's gonna do it for this charity shop so i picked up one of the best hauls ever actually i've got a whole bunch of movies right here there's one two three eight. there's loads i can't even count them at the moment because they're literally falling everywhere but if you've enjoyed this episode make sure you hit that like button and that subscribe button check down below for a link to my vintage and go buy some of my vintage stuff and i will see you guys in the next episode thanks for watching goodbye